Hello again and welcome to part two of the medic game I was playing. I'm Insane Acorn, as you should know because you're watching my video, and I've got another, well, the other half of the of the um, medic series I was playing. It's it's, it's about ten minutes long. Um, this this video, so oh, I can't remember where where I left off in the last commentary. I've done that last night, and I'm doing this now. I'm literally about to compile it and upload it as soon as I've done the commentary. So. As you can see, I decided to hop into a UAV because, well, I just feel like it, you know, I don't really get to play in the UAV much and it's actually quite fun when you know what you're doing. I'm not too great in it, you know, as you can see, I've seen a guy shooting at me from down here, I couldn't see him. If you guys can spot him, yeah, let me know. Because <laughs> I, I tried to find him and I couldn't, and I'm still scanning now, but, yeah. I, my intention there was to launch the Hellfire missile or whatever it is, you know, just, you get a rocket with a UAV at at the um, at the bomb site because that all, it always does damage to it but then you know, it got blown up so I didn't have a chance so then I just about to die so I thought why not suicide it into this guy and miss so yeah and a few videos ago in my first proper video I spoke about how EA had ruined the battlefield experience for me and I just want to talk about that a little bit because they have you know they 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 make the game well they they publish it even and they add their twist to it, which is the EA server, which is god annoying. Oh, so many times I've disconnected from the EA server after playing a full round, right? And I lose all my stats, right? Every why? Just let us let us do it how we always do it on other things. And as well, I think there's no host migration, so if the host leaves, I think or it just I don't know if there is host on this, but if some you know if. It's happened to me a few times. I see some guy leave and then it disconnects. So, but you just lose all your stats for that game, and you know sometimes you're right near, near the end. But that's EA for you. They don't learn. They just have their stupid servers. So, carrying on as a medic, you know I want to be supporting my team. Usually running around the defibs, so I'll be doing that a lot. And uh, we're taking up these points. I mean, I'm hanging around because there's usually guys. Every single time you take bases, the people try to hang around to pick you off as you spawn. And as you'll see here. Uh, I see some guy, so one of my teammates gets shot, so I run to help him, and I get shot myself, which is annoying. Yeah, well, see, I decided not to cut out the deaths in this because, well, I only usually I only usually cut them out to save time, and uh, I couldn't be bothered. You know, time wasn't a factor. This was quite a good game all the way through, so I thought I'd just post the whole match. So. Oh, I, what I also want to talk about is proper teamwork. You know, don't piss off your teammates if you're playing. I was playing a hardcore match a while ago, a couple of days ago even, um, with Causey from Gaming Legit. He's a really nice guy. You know, he he, he knows how to play this game. We had a few game, a couple of games. It was quite good. But there was a guy in our squad who just randomly killed him for no apparent reason. You know, he even said, "Dude, dude, what was that for?" And he's like, "I he didn't he didn't know. He just said I don't know." Now I'm guessing he was trying to get that kill five teammates. Uh, achievement or something like that or whatever crap it is but you know he didn't say that so if you're gonna do you know crap like that tell the person tell ask you ask first you know because you, you're just gonna piss people off and he ended and um, cause he ended up leaving that game because you know this is a team-based game you don't kill your teammates like that it's just stupid um, I, 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 I've tried to have a few set things to talk about but I've forgotten them all already that's how terrible I am at remembering things sometimes but uh, at the moment, I can see my team's not really pushing that hard. I mean, some of them are going for it, but most of them are getting killed coming down this ridge. So I'm just basically staying back. But now I now I go in a Rambo style kind of game. <laughs> I just get you know I just get bored of just sitting back and I think, well nobody's taking care of B, so why don't I go after B? So in a minute you'll see me do a proper Rambo style through the water because. You, you can go through water, you know, you, you, you don't drown or anything, you, you just can't fire, fire your weapon. So on this map, try to go through the water if you can, which is what I'm doing now. I, re I, I didn't realise that Sniper had shot the guy in my squad. I only realised that once I got down here. So, sorry about that. <laughs> I should have paid more attention, but flanking is so important in this game. You, nobody watches the water. I mean, sometimes I play this game, just nobody watches the water at all. It's, you can just go through the water. Just do it. Just try it once or a few times. There's a guarantee no one will be there. I mean, if they go against a smart team, they'll have a guy placed, you know, constantly guarding this area, which is what I try to do, you know. And uh, my team are pushing for A, and you can see they've just set the charge at Alpha. 
So I thought, well, the whole team's going to be rushing towards A, so why not take B as well? Which is pretty good. I mean, I managed to get the bomb plant, as you can see. Quite nifty. And then I run away, blah, 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 blah. I decide to go underneath because it's just a great place to be. No one looks down there. <laughs> this guy, what's he doing? <laughs> he just runs towards me and I just... Oh. <laughs> Boom! <laughs> but they managed to disarm my charge, so I thought, whatever. You know, this is my Rambo-style gameplay, <laughs> you know? LMG solo style. <laughs> it, it doesn't last very long. But I've done quite well to be on my own. Now, I'm not sure how many of you noticed my commentating style. I don't really talk about what's going on on screen. I mean, I talk about key points. As you can see, that we jump straight through the hole, didn't realize you can arm it from underneath, but apparently you can, so never mind. But I don't commentate on what's actually going on on the screen. I mean, you can see that for yourselves. You're not blind, yeah? You can see what, what I'm doing. You know, I will commentate on the main key points that I'm doing. Yeah, you know, I, I can't, you know, because it'll be so boring if you just say, yeah, I'm waiting in the water now. I'm just looking at B. I planted it. You know, it's, what's the point? I mean, yeah, you can be a little more exciting and just go really fast talking. Blah, 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 but not really much point, but... So I get, I managed to get B on my own, which was quite impressive, to be, to be honest. But you've got to watch out now, because everybody's going for that. You've only got one point to attack, and they've only got one point to defend. And that is such a choke, when you've only got one point to defend. Because they're not spread out, you know. They're going to be more together. They're, 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 their morale's either boosted because they think we've got one point left or it's dropped so they're going to be panicking and, and swarming which can be good but when when your team's not working together either it's just difficult uh, we don't actually manage to take this point I don't think because my team wasn't pushing enough I mean I was the only one up front and I realized we're running out of tickets so I better start doing my job later and I should have done my job all the way through you know I've got loads of points but Otherwise, if I did, we wouldn't have even taken B. I don't think if I didn't push forward. So what, one of one of your team has to make the charge, and you got and the others will follow suit. Usually, you know, they've got to see some sort of morale boost. You know, you've got to see if you know you might, if even if one of you breaks through and plants the bomb, and then it gets disarmed straight away. At least they know, hey, we've got a bomb plant. You know, it is possible we can break through. It, it's a mind game as well, even though it is just a game. <laughs> I realise we've got about 20, yeah, 20 tickets now. I, I go for the charge. It doesn't quite work. I had an LMG. What did that guy have? See, oh, it's 12% health. That's stupid. I don't get this game sometimes. But anyway, I decide to spawn in this tank because <laughs> it's a tank, you know. Uh, surprisingly, I don't do very well in it. It was quite odd. I was getting loads of hit markers in a tank, which is, you know, usually it's like a couple of shots and they're down. But see, hit marker. And there should be a hit marker. That bat should have downed that guy. It's a bloody tank. <laughs> hit marker. Hit marker. What? And then like, you can't bloody see because your bloody teammates are firing away constantly. Why? Ooh. So, uh, any, if you, anything you're going to take away from these videos is work as a team and do your job. I should have killed that guy instead of an assist. That pissed me off. Do your job, you know, and attack. Don't be scared, because you, if, if you attack and you manage to break through, you get your tickets back up to 75. Yeah, you, uh, uh, so, even if you're down to a, a couple of tickets left, you know, what have you got to... Yeah, sure, you're about to lose the game, but if you, if you just sit back and waste those tickets, what's the point, you know? Try and do the objective. I mean, we're down to 11 now, so the match is pretty much over. Which is... Mm, it was annoying. I mean, what I will post one day. I will post a video in which I win. <laughs> you know, uh, I plan to next time. So, but it's actually quite hard to find games that are good to commentate on and such because people want to see a good KD. People want to see you doing your job. People want to see you win. And to fill all three of these criteria in in one match is extremely rare. This is Battlefield. You know, you're not going to have a, a an over one KD usually. I mean, I mean, I know my KD's sitting at one right now, but. What are you going to do? So, be patient with me, you know? And uh, this is the last video I'm going to do for about two or three weeks because I'm going away to Syria in well, on Thursday. So I'm going there for two weeks. I won't be back. When I'm back even, I have loads of work to get done. 
So if I can get a, a match posted, then I will. But if I can't, I'm sorry. I will put more up soon. And the video diary. I'm, I'll, I'll probably do a video diary one day and just do that as a series. I, don't, I know you probably don't care, but... Uh, well, I don't care what you think. <laughs> you know, it's, it's my channel. I'll do what I work with it. So, ha! I don't mean to sound like a twat, to be honest, but as you can see, we lose the match. I get a nice, um, I get, I get, I do get quite good stats in this, but if you like these videos, please um, rate and subscribe, rate what you think's fair. Um, it's been nice talking to you. I'm your host, Insane Acorn, and I'll see you next time.